Is this still the city? That's as close as I could get to a lawnmower. I couldn't get grass, couldn't get more lawnmower. Just something that cuts things. Um, let the story commence. Craig, let's do something a little bit different. I'm in the mood for something. Recently, I've been in the mood for something different. Let's try something different. Craig wanted to buy a new lawnmower. It wasn't the one you plug but plug in, but it's one you put, you know, like uh, like fuel in, you know, like uh, uh, diesel. He wasn't sure if it was petrol or diesel or, or what. When he opened up the cap and looked inside, it was like a mad portal. And he went, oh no, and kind of fell into it and got weir and then spiralling around like that. Oh no. When he came at the other end, it was a land that was all grass. Grass that was grown, no cut grass. And every blade of grass had eyes and a mouth. And it was all normal sized grass. It wasn't like big giant sort of thing, like big blade of grass that size, with two eyes like that, that my size. Each, every tiny wee blade of grass. And, and, a, mouth, and a mouth. And they went like that. You must stop. Why are you cutting us? We're real. We can feel things. Go back to your world and tell everyone. And Craig went, oh, I couldn't believe us. And he tripped up, banged his head. He went, oh. When he woke up, he was next to his lawnmower back in the real world. And he thought, right, what happened? Either what just, what I think just happened, happened. And I'm back here. Or two, I maybe tripped up and banged my head. Um, and dreamt that. But I don't actually remember falling. I don't remember falling, you know, banging my head. I don't remember falling, banging my head. And then I wake up. The last thing I remember was looking into the... the what's its name? The, the fuel bit. So why did that happen? Ah... Fumes. He opened up the cap. He looked at. It, it must have when he was looking, and it must have been the fumes. The fumes hit his head. He felt all oh, like that. Then he fell during that at some point. Banged his head. Woke up. Had a dream when he was sleeping. That was it. But here's the thing: while he was sleeping, um, the lawnmower. Um, it did actually have an electrical option. Had a cable. And some wee bastard had plugged it in while he was sleeping. And he didn't notice this because see if you've been hurt, see, your, ba your, your body can only hold so much pain and then it goes off the chart, basically. There's just, there's a limit. There's a there's an upper limit to the uh, pain. Um, and when it gets so painful, your body actually goes like, you know what, enough's enough. Your body throws in the towel. It's like a fucking, you know, like chucking in the towel or it's like a doctor going like that. Stop the fight. And you go numb. You don't feel anything like adrenaline and stuff like that. It turns out some wee bastard. When he was when Craig was conked out, had actually plugged in the um the the lawnmower to a, a mobile battery that he had. Because that's the if you if you know you guys seen some of these external batteries you got you have to have now? Yeah, they've got phones like, oh, the phones are getting smaller, but oh, you have to have this external battery. It's like size of a bloody house. So now they're bringing out these batteries that can actually power like a lawnmower. Like you can actually plug the mains into it. Have you seen this? You, you guys seen this? It's like, you know, you plug the USB in, then you've got this other USB thing, and then you've got an actual, you know, three prong, 240 volt uh, socket. You guys seen this, right? And this wee bastard had plugged in the lawnmower and went air uh, Craig's face. But it was so painful that Craig couldn't feel it. Crazy, right? How the body works, right? Biology, right? And Craig looked, it didn't know. He saw it in the distance, the wee guy running away laughing. And Craig thought, wee bastard laughing at me because I tripped, you know, I conked out. And then Craig looked in the reflection uh, in a nearby window and he saw 
that his face had been taken off. But here's the thing. He had been lying on cut grass because some of the grass was cut while the, the wee bastard was gone at his face. It did actually cut some of the grass. And some of the grass had went in his uh, face and taken root. And I don't know if you know, you know how like compost can help like grass grow and things like that? Actually plugging grass into live, like a live body makes it grow even faster. The whole front of his face, because the whole front of his face was taken off, it's grass. Luscious grass, and we're talking about moss and all that, like creep show, Stephen King's been creep show. Luscious, like, and, and really tight together, you know, like a golf course. Really good. Or like uh, lawn balls, actually really good. And a guy came up to me and went like that, with a rosette, and went, first prize, and this cunt was a thick specs like Mr. Magoo, he went like that, first prize to you. Uh, he went like, here you go. Your first prize to you, Waldo. Here you go. Oh, yes, this first prize to you, Waldo. Not like Mr. Magoo. <laughs> he was looking for the the place to actually. He was meant to be getting an award for the best grass in a um a garden festival. Took a wrong turn, the daft cunt, and. Uh, and, you know, Craig could... Can, I'm just going to stop it out because that's it's actually a true story. I, 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 hope, I hope you weren't expecting a, um, some sort of big funny punchline. The reason why it just stops there is because it's actually a true story. And Craig uh, told me that two days ago and he said they are, somebody did a crowdfunder, a fundraiser, so he could get an operation. It's The experts are in America and he had to, it was a bit two million or something to fly him out there and get the operation and everything to get his face put back to normal. Uh, and he's, after people gained the two million, he decided he actually wants to just keep it the way it is. And I said, well, what happened to the two million? Oh, that, does that get refunded or something? He went, no, I got that fair and square. I said, I for the operation, but you're not having the operation, so you're going to refund the people. And he went, no, the people gave me that money to spend on what I wanted. What I wanted at the time was the operation. I've decided that's not what I want. So I'm going to be keeping that money. And so I, funnily enough, grasped him in to the polis and the polis this is unbelievable kind of, it's just typical do you know, the, you know what the punishment was do you know what the punishment was for him uh, embezzling two fucking million mhm mm mhm mm yeah PS6 PlayStation 6 PlayStation 6, two pool tables, exercise room, and uh, three square meals uh, a day on a roof area seat. We're getting like courses in there. He's in jail. We're getting like courses. How to be a better person. How can I know day that? How can they not offer that before they go to jail? Where's the system in place? To go, listen, you're in a bad place, we can help you. Um, so I've put a hit out on him because I think it's fucking disgusting. It's a joke. I'm no fucking right wing. I'm no right wing at all. Uh, I'm no centrist or anything like that at all. But this makes a fucking mockery out of what I would consider to be my values. It's a mockery. 
and the right are going to jump on this and they're going to use it to try and get rid of the lot of it. So I feel that I have to do something to make it a wee bit right so to get these arseholes off, off the fucking case. So I've put a hit out in them. Um, I'm getting them stabbed in there. And I'm getting the PS6. And on Monday, I will be streaming from the PS6 and it'll look exactly like this. Because it uses AI, it looks at the scenario and goes, we'll make it just like that. And I'll be streaming Grand Theft Auto 6 on Monday. Getting a mode done. I was wanting to get a mode done. Like, you know, like, like we're going to think it'd be funny. He got mode done because you know the lawnmower thing. But no, they're going to just, it's like a plastic fucking knife. They sharpen a, a toothbrush. They sharpen the end of a toothbrush and, and his neck like that. Because I was, I was like that, like uh, breaking bad. I said, so, so you're going to do it this way? They were, we'll do it. You're going to do it that, but just they went like, just leave it to us. Just fucking calm it. We do this all the time. <laughs> 